Sakafet YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Let us make this moist and delicious orange loaf cake. darlings let us make this gorgeous orange loaf cake in a bowl i've got my flour and i'm going in with some salt baking soda baking powder and setting to one side i'm now gonna go ahead and just grate the zest of two oranges into my bowl this doesn't take long to do and basically all you're doing is just getting the orange bits out of the skin so you don't want to grate any of the white parts just the orange bits So the same two oranges that we got the zest out of, I'm just going to go ahead and juice it and set it to one side. In a separate bowl, I'm gonna go ahead and crack three eggs and I'm gonna remove that little white stuff from the egg just because it's not something that I like to keep in my eggs whenever I'm cooking it or baking it or whatever. And yeah, set the eggs to one side and then we're just gonna start by combining everything. To my eggs I also added some lemon extract because I don't have orange extract so I use some lemon extract instead and now I'm just going in in a larger bowl with my eggs I'm gonna whisk it for about 10 seconds or so you can use a hand mixer but I'm just doing everything by hand today so after 10 seconds go ahead and add in your vegetable oil and I'm just gonna go ahead and mix that in well make sure you check down below in the description box for all of the ingredients that I'm using today and after mixing your oil and eggs together we're gonna go ahead and add in our orange juice and mix that in for another 10 seconds Once our orange juice has been combined, I'm gonna go in and add in my sugar, give it a quick whisk for about 5 to 10 seconds or so, and then we're just gonna start sifting in our dry ingredients in the wet ingredients, okay?
that we have a beautiful batter coming on i'm just gonna add my orange zest to this batter give it a quick mix again now guys be very mindful of over mixing your batter you don't want to do this at all and then once everything is all combined i must say that i have preheated my oven to 180 degrees celsius while i'm doing this so my oven is nice and hot when this loaf is ready to go in So I've gone ahead and just lined my loaf tin with a loaf liner and I'm just gonna pour this batter into the pan. Now this can make an 8 inch cake if you want to but I prefer a loaf. I just think they finish so much quicker and then I don't have lots of cake going to waste. So yes, add your batter into the loaf pan. Then you want to tap it down for about 3 times just to get rid of any air bubbles or anything like that. And then we're gonna pop it into the oven to bake for about an hour, 10 to 15 minutes until a skewer comes out clean. So this is how it looks after about an hour and 10 to 15 minutes. I did garnish with some orange slices on the top. I think it looked really pretty. But then I thought, okay, let's just make a little icing, a little drizzle, a little something to go on the top. This is entirely optional, but yeah, allow your cake to cool before you do any of this. So I'm just going to go ahead and remove it from the loaf pan. Then we're going to make a little um, orange icing drizzle something just to put on the top. The icing drizzle all you will need is some icing sugar just a little bit of orange juice mix it in well i'm also adding in a little bit of zest as well just for a little color a little something mix that in well and then you just want to start drizzling it all over the cake now this is optional but i think it just adds a nice little touch a little something to it you can add more icing sugar if you want this to be a bit thicker but i actually didn't have any more so this is why my texture is quite runny yeah once it's all drizzled on the top you can let it set for a about five ten minutes before cutting into it and yes my darlings this is it all done so i'm gonna slice into this to show you how amazing the texture looks on the inside because it was so moist so delicious absolutely gorgeous so i really hope you enjoy this lemon loaf not lemon loaf i have made a lemon loaf before though <laughs> i really hope you enjoy this orange loaf cake and try the recipe soon let me know if you like it it's been a pleasure having you here and i'll see you again in my next one i do apologize for the fact that i am um i have a little bit of a sore throat so i've been struggling with a sore throat for about a week now and it's just horrible <laughs> so i really hope you guys were able to understand what i'm saying and um hopefully this sore throat goes away quick and then i can go back to my bubbly lively voiceovers <laughs> thank you so much for watching bye bye